Blue Jays outfielder Curtis Granderson has been all over the world in his role as an ambassador for Major League Baseball. Netherlands, China, Japan. One of the trips he made was to South Africa back in 2007. One of the players who happened to attend one of his baseball clinics was Gift and GoPay. The two players are now teammates here in Toronto when their story has come full circle. I got a chance to bring my dad with me and one of my buddies by the name of Joe Lacey out there and it was the first time I ever stepped into the continent of Africa. You know, somebody from Chicago, you see things that you uh, envision hopefully getting a chance to do and now here I'm going as a baseball ambassador promoting the game of baseball to an area that doesn't necessarily have baseball as one of its most popular sports. So it was a really, really cool trip. Got a chance to see a bunch of things from baseball to animals to places where they filmed Shark Week and met a bunch of great people along the way. You know what, I don't remember 100% at that time, but the crazy thing last year once he had made his debut uh, with the Pittsburgh Pirates, I got a chance to get to second base and he came up to me right away. He goes, hey, I met you during the South Africa trip and it just brought me back to that. And for me, it was like, wow, you know, I got a chance to meet somebody during the baseball ambassador trip. And part of the reason why they brought me over there was again to promote the game, to hopefully get the first major league baseball player to come out of it. And he was the guy. And I had a chance to have a little bit of impact today. And now here we are together wearing Blue Jays uniforms, going out there, doing a lot of the same things we talked about back in 2007 and now instead of me being the one teaching him I'm learning from him and we're going out there trying the best to improve our careers and, and make the most of it. I remember him being there in 2007 uh, they said the uh, Detroit Tigers major league baseball players coming down and uh, everybody was excited to meet him um, then he was there for a short little period of time in, in Johannesburg and uh, he coached some of the kids and, and told them um, stories about the major leagues and just gave them inspiration to you know wanting to pursue a career in baseball man he broke down a bunch of barriers and paths and he's definitely had a very interesting road I asked him I said how did you get introduced to the game and he said his mom actually brought him into the game so especially here in the states you think of a lot of people learning about the game with father and son playing catch and his is a little different and then his mother passed away so to go ahead and not hold that against and let me step away but continue to go ahead and embrace it and continue to move forward with it and now here he is at this point and having some adversity and being able to go through it. I mean, that's what this game is all about. You're going to have a lot of failures, but it's about how many times you can continue to get back up. And he's definitely doing it. He comes to the ballpark every day with a smile on his face, ready to work. It's good to be uh, reunited with him. Um, he's very experienced. He's been in the major leagues for a little while. And uh, I get to pick his brain and, and see what he's learned and what he's uh, you know, made adjustments in his career in, in order to be where he is today. So. It's, so I can better my game and, and you know have a long career um, ahead of me. It's always good to give back um, to the community. Um, they've done a lot to a lot for me uh, in South Africa. Everybody helped me to to be be where I am today. And so giving back to you know the community and doing stuff for them and and you know doing different camps. Uh, the MLB uh, Academy invited me to coach, and uh, you know I just try to be a role model and try to inspire the kids um, each and every single day. Um, this year there was a couple of uh, camps that we ran, uh, Play Sport for Life, uh, done in Cape Town with uh, Miles October. Um, and I know a bunch of other guys that are doing uh, great work in, in trying to develop baseball in South Africa.